Play clock down to one. They snap it on second and 17. Levis over the middle has a man wide open, and the catch is made into Miami territory. DeAndre Hopkins. Baltimore Ravens defense, both defensive coordinators coming from that. John Harbaugh coaching tree. Oh, nearly intercepted. It was juggled by Emmanuel Agba. Dolphins winning like they have it. His first snap as a Dolphin. It's a high one. And he's looking to throw over the middle and gets it right away to Jalen Waddle. Kind of mistakes that just prove costly to the young quarterback. Tyreek Kill in motion. He's got the football. It'll juke inside, cuts outside, and the cheetah gets loose. And he will be creative to get him touches, and it's a screen pass. He dropped that's a backwards pass. Gotta be careful. It's picked up by the Titans. I did not think that was a forward pass. Scooped up by Arden Key. Whew. And that appears to be backwards. Hill kind of went after it for a while and tried to knock it out of bounds. Wasn't successful. If and you're Brian Callahan, you've got to up. challenge that, right? Prior to the challenge flag being thrown out, replay assist determined that it was a backward pass recovered by the defense at the 36-yard line. Concept inside. That's been his guy, Calvin Ridley. Levis on the move. And trying to get there with his legs, he just dives with the football extended. It's near the marker at the 46. That number between the area, between the hashes and the numbers. Pressure comes. Huntley never has a chance. Didn't see it off the edge. And knocked down by Harold Landry the third, who was a game wrecker a year ago. Hands the football off and banging ahead is Tajay Spears. He's looking to his left and said, pressure comes, but it's a strike for a first down. This did. In second and 12, Mason across the middle and throw just behind the man, but he went back to make the catches. Traylon Burks, Tennessee offense. Spears was in motion there. He's got the football, but he's going absolutely nowhere. Grabbed and slung backwards there by Storm Duck, the rookie corner out of Louisville. Closing in on the big 4-0. He'll turn 40 in November. He just keeps kicking, and he keeps making them. Big Tabandre Sweat, 93. In the middle there, tough to move the 366-pounder. Huntley is a runner, but not much room here now. It's a fourth down and about a yard at the 46. Alec Ingle, the fullback, lined up outside of the tight end hill. HN is the back. And there's Tyreek in motion. Got the handoff. Had to curve backwards, and he didn't get there. The penetration forced him to reroute. Quandre Diggs knocking him out. Kenneth Murray was involved. Spears off the right side. Has a little crease. Makes a cut. Ridley goes in motion. Spears has the football. Big burst. Plowing forward. Running with... First round pick out of Penn State. At the bottom of the screen. Deflected on the edge there. Ridley makes the catch. Now tries to make something of it. Cutting back. Calvin Ridley... Move it just 19 yards and full. Good from 53 earlier and good from 52 there. Already have five tonight. Running right and Chen motions out. Huntley took a look that way but takes off. Snoop Huntley dives down right at the marker. He has been very good running routes lined up as a receiver. It's on the far side. Waddle. Four for six on the season, and this is from 44. And he knocks it right through. Rush three. Bruno has plenty of time. Fires down the middle, and the catch is made by Boyd and Tyler Boyd. The 30, they got to hurry up and spike it. They got 27 yards there on a third long field goal of the half. And he is three for three, knocks it through from 47. And he seems to be a little comfortable doing it. Third and ten. Huntley back pedaling and just throws it down incomplete. It was Janu Smith in the neighborhood to have been back inside their 15. And he figures to be a steady diet of Tony Pollard is bunches to the left. And that's Ridley going in motion. And dropped. Coming in on the pressure was Jordan Brooks knocking down Rudolph on that last punt and then chaos ensued from his goal line that's a good punt best of the night driving Barrios all the way back to the 25 can he get a couple blocks on the edge yes 
Back to Barrios. Oh, just tripped up near midfield, or he was eyeballing the end zone. Need 11 for the first down. A short game, and at least give Jason Sanders a better chance at a field goal. And again, this feels like a big play. They took over in plus territory off the big punt return and stall immediately. Sanders drives it through. That would have been good from 65. I mean, he hammered it. Pollard on second and nine knives through. Tony Pollard in a foot race. Run out of bounds inside the 10. Holland saved the touchdown with the first electric offensive play we've seen all night. To take a direct snap. That's Pollard who comes in motion. Fake it to him. And the wrinkle works. And Tennessee first to reach the end zone tonight. With how he's performing. Play fake. And Huntley backpedaling trying to survive. And he'll be dropped behind the line by Sebastian Joseph Day. Inside out when it comes to going to the ball. Huntley was just going to launch right down the middle of the field. He's got hell, but he overthrew him. Pollard. I still crease in the Miami defense. To a tunnel by low. Third down. Spears dropped for a short loss. Information. Folk back out there. He's been a long range kicking machine tonight. And they don't want to keep calling him. They keep throwing the ball everywhere else. The pitch to the outside. You need two yards to move the six here. You expect this would be four down territory, but Huntley dancing around runs a long way to get back near the marker. Hopes alive of a comeback here down 13. Out of the shotgun, handoff, and going nowhere is a chan. Uh, an offense that for the better part of two and a half weeks has been bad. Into round. Calvin Ridley makes a nice little cut and dives down. Did he even take a shot at the end zone here on third and goal? Up 13. The answer is yes. It's incomplete. Trying to find McConkwell the tight end. Nick Polk, meanwhile, will tie his own career record with five field goals in the game. Hardcore Tennessee Titan fans or devotees of defensive football. Welcome back. Tyreek Hill over the middle. <laughs> 17-yard gain back to the ground right bursting through spinning down near the 32 so Second and 20 hunt Lee will escape the pocket On a green grass in front of him a little stutter step and he'll be knocked out of bounds Well, they pitch it off to right and the third down woes continue Big to Andre Sweat at 366 pounds got out there on the edge and bear hugged the ball carrier. First down run, fourth and 11 here. Down 16, got to have it. They flip it short and trying to make the play. And finally, scooting for a first down is Jalen Waddell. Can you use Kyler Huntley's athletic ability? Straight run, Huntley will barrel into the end zone and finally. Miami reaches the end zone, and that drought is over. One possession game. Off the play fake. Flipped into the end zone and is intercepted. And reaching up the paw was Quandre Diggs. And the left side of this offensive line has shown you tonight the kind of power. An eye formation handoff to Pollard. The kind of power that it has. Only from the end zone has to throw it away. A diving interception attempt. Two grounding offense number 18. If the foul occurred in the end zone, it is a safety. So now all the Titans come up, and it's going to be that, well, that sky punt, which you can just, on the bounce, they get away from it. And <laughs> they, they didn't call an onside kick. In this situation, the kicker kicked the ball beyond the landing zone so there's a, a penalty for illegal kick and it's enforced from the 20 yard line half the distance to the 10 would be first down and it's been even slightly lower scoring than expected Pollard makes a cut mm, within 
Jalen Phillips, what happened to him tonight? Yep. What is he dealing with? Yeah. Hollard again. We have big number 60, Daniel Brunskill, playing fullback, and they hand it off to Pollard, who's trying to bounce it to the edge. Pollard going for the pylon, diving, signal, touchdown, what a wave. Tennessee. A wave of emotion. To Rudolph off the bench when Will Levis injured his shoulder, and the veteran gets the job done, along with a running game and a stout defense. And Tennessee gets in the win column for the first time. Both teams now sitting at one and three.